go ahead on your start menu and right click here we want to go to risk management please go ahead and click on action and here we want to create vhd now go ahead and click on browse and select the location for your virtual hd i want to make it in c drive and here i want to make a new folder and name it vhd let's open this folder and here i want to name it virtual usb let's click on save how much storage you want to assign to your this virtual usb i want to assign it 13 gigs of storage click on unknown disk one that is unallocated space and click initialize disk click ok and now i want to go to unallocated space and i want to create a new simple volume let's click next confirm the storage you have assigned again click next the letter i want to assign to my virtual usb let's click next again volume label let's go ahead and again type it virtual usb let's click next again and then finish now our virtual usb is ready we want to go to microsoft official windows download website and we want to download iso file for windows 11 and select windows 11 multi edition please go ahead and choose your required language now we are ready to download the latest windows 11 64 bit iso file click on download and select your location so here i got the windows 11 64 bit english variant download file we will make our usb bootable with this iso file for that we have to download rufus software please go ahead and open it in your browser and download the standard or portable one now here i got my virtual usb at the top now here please go ahead and click on select because we have already downloaded the windows 11 latest official iso file that is 64 bit and also if you want you could go ahead and change this option and now we are ready and we could start making our usb drive bootable by selecting all of these options all the data on the device virtual usb will be destroyed continue this operation click ok now this will delete and format the USB. This will remove the bad log. Check for all the required options that we have selected and will make our virtual USB a bootable USB with Windows 11 ISO file. Now let's go ahead and close this reference tool. We want to go to this PC and here we could see we got our windows 11 that got bootable in our virtual usb and we could go ahead and proceed with the setup